Today I'm sharing some kimono outfit ideas. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. My name is Tamala, and here on this channel, we are all about style and confidence at any size. So if you like the video and you like what you see, then be sure to stick around and subscribe for more. We would love to have you guys join a part of our little family. And don't forget to hit the bell so that you're notified every time I upload a new video. Like I said before, today I'm going to be sharing some kimono outfit ideas. So if y'all are interested in seeing that, then just keep watching. So we are going to go ahead and jump right into it. I love kimonos. I actually don't wear them often in videos because they make a lot of like little noise in the microphone. I'm hoping you guys can hear it, but those little noises can be really loud in the microphone. So I don't wear them a lot in videos, but they're one of the easiest, most affordable ways I feel like to up level an outfit. And all the kimonos I'm going to show you guys today are from Amazon, which is coincidentally my favorite place to get kimonos. I mean, they have the best ones the perfect length and they're at the perfect price and all of these are less than $20 and I'm wearing an XXL in all of them. They are just kimonos are the perfect finishing piece for summer, spring and also going into fall. I feel like they're a great transition piece. So the first outfit that I'm going to share with you guys is just a basic outfit, like a super basic outfit and then adding a pop of color with a kimono. So we have a basic pair of distressed jeans with a knotted white tee and then this rainbow um, kimono, which I absolutely love with my entire whole heart. And it's great because you just took that really basic outfit of, you know, distressed jeans and a white tee and you added something different to it and you added a pop of color because I don't know about you guys, but for me, a lot of my wardrobe just tends to be more neutral most of the time. And so this is a really great way to just add some color in there and make an otherwise boring outfit just a little bit more interesting. Next, we have a classic outfit combination of a bodycon and a kimono. So I have this black bodycon dress with a tropical kimono. And I love this combination for so many reasons. First of all, I think kimonos look great over bodycon dresses because you get that really nice contrast of a really fitted bodycon dress with a more loose and flowy kimono. It just adds just a really nice like visual element. It also adds a really great pop of color if you're wearing a more neutral bodycon dress like I am here. It adds a really nice pop of color there, but it also is a great way to dress up or dress down a bodycon because bodycons, when you think about it, they're super basic, super simple, not a lot of thought goes into them, really easy to throw on, and you can dress them up or you can dress them down. And there are also kimonos that you can dress up or dress down. They're very versatile. I love it. You guys know I love a good versatile piece of clothing. And it's also a great way to cover your arms if you're not comfortable with them. I know a lot of us struggle with that and body confidence and that sort of a thing. And I think it's a great way to kind of show your arms without showing them because I know if you are uncomfortable with your arms, it's, it probably gets a little difficult in the spring and the summer times when it's very hot. You don't really want to be covered by anything because it is so hot. And this, like they're super thin, they're not going to be too hot. So it's a great way if you're just a little bit uncomfortable and want to cover your arms that you can without kind of just being way too hot. And they're just cute. I mean, come on. It's just, it's a really cute outfit. Next, we have a basic pair of denim shorts, a black tee, and this, I don't even know what kind of a print to call this kimono. I said this in the last one. It reminds me of like a rug, but like a really cute rug, not a bad rug, a cute rug. Um, and I'll link that Amazon haul above and down below where I showed this, but I love this one. It is, it's so pretty. And I love pairing a kimono with a pair of shorts because a great um, positive about that is, again, if you're not really comfortable with shorts or you're trying to get into them, I totally recommend, you know, experimenting in different things in your wardrobe. And if you're just not quite sure about them, you don't know how they make you feel, it's great to add a kimono to it because it kind of covers up you a little bit. So it kind of covers up the legs and the back a little bit. It kind of gives you a little bit um, more security. So if that makes sense, if you're not quite comfortable with it and you want to be, it's a great way to kind of test shorts out and still feel a little bit more covered. And again, which I feel like is always a positive, it adds a bright pop of color to an otherwise neutral outfit. I feel like that is one of the, the biggest pluses with this because you don't, I don't feel like I buy a lot of jackets. Now I love me a good blazer, but I don't feel like I buy a lot of finishing, that's my dog sneezing, can you hear that? Bless you, buddy. Um, a lot of over pieces, I guess you would say, finishing pieces that are super colorful and kimonos are a great way to do that without breaking the bank. And then last but certainly not least, I have this pink t-shirt dress with sort of this blue and pink floral print kimono. And the great thing about this is that it's another example of wearing it with a dress, but bringing out the color instead of adding a color. So instead of having a more neutral dress and adding a pop of color, you're kind of bringing out a color that already exists in the dress, which again, I think is another really pretty way to style it. So you can always go more neutral and then add a pop, or you can always just bring that color out. I think either way is really, really pretty, but 
that is the end of this video guys i know it was a really short one but kimonos are seriously one of the easiest pieces to style and they are perfect for nearly all seasons i mean you can find a way to use them literally in almost any outfit make them cute with almost any outfit and they're just really easy so if you're kind of just getting into styling getting into fashion if you're just wanting to try something different i think kimonos are a great um, resource because they are super easily accessible and very inexpensive so with that being said, thank y'all so, so much for watching. As always, leave a comment down below and let me know which kimono was y'all's favorite. And I really hope that y'all enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you have not already. And I will see you guys in the next one. Like I'm better off